Stony Brook University has created a new GPNC option for undergraduate students. This video tutorial will review the details of this new policy and walk you through the steps to select the GPNC option on Solar. The GPNC option allows you to select a minimum grade for a course. If you earn that minimum grade or higher, it will appear on your transcript and factor into your GPA. If you earn less than the minimum grade you select, but earn at least a D, a P will appear on your transcript, and if you earn an F, an NC will appear on your transcript. Courses not available for the GPNC option are noted in the bulletin course descriptions. The GPNC option is available for only one course per semester, regardless of the number of credits of the course. Summer 1 and 2 is considered one semester. The GPNC option cannot be selected for repeated courses. You can select the GPNC option through the end of the ninth week in the fall and spring semesters and as noted on the Registrar's Office calendar for winter and summer. You can change between the graded and GPNC option until the GPNC deadline. It's important that you carefully select and review your GPNC option on Solar as you cannot make changes after the deadline. So let's take a look at the GPNC option in more detail. Click on Enrollment under Student Records and Registration. Click on Edit a Class. Now you'll need to select the class from your schedule that you wish to edit. Proceed to step two of three. And then click on the drop down box next to graded. Please note the default selection is general A through F undergraduate graded. Below that we can begin to see the options for the GPNC. Please note that the plus and minuses are not in order. So let's take a look at a couple scenarios. Some students might select the C grade threshold because most major classes require a grade of C or higher. If you select this grade threshold, it means that you are willing to accept any grade of C or higher. But if you earn a C minus, D plus, or D, then you will earn a P. And if you earn an F, an NC will appear on your transcript. Some students might select the D grade threshold. If you select this grade threshold, it means that you are willing to accept any grade of D or higher, but if you earn an F, an NC will appear on your transcript. So let's select D or higher. Hit Next. Now you can see an additional comment box under New Value, which further explains the GPNC option that you chose. A D or higher earns the grade on your transcript and an F gets an NC, no credit. Click on Finish Editing, and you will get a confirmation page about whether the class was updated successfully or if there was an error. This class was updated successfully, so now we can click on My Class Schedule. Now we can see under EGL 204 that the grading has been changed. It is recommended that you print this screen and keep it for your records. Please note that once you select the GPNC option for a class, it will no longer appear as an option for any other classes in that term. If you wish to change your GPNC selection, you will need to first change that course back to the undergraduate graded option and then select your new course with the GPNC option. Please keep apprised of the academic deadlines for which you can elect the GPNC option. These deadlines are noted in the academic calendar, which can be found on the registrar's website. Visit stonybrook.edu forward slash registrar. Click on academic calendars. Now you can select the academic calendar of the semester you wish to view. If you'd like to learn more about the GPNC option, head on over to the undergraduate bulletin. Enter GPNC in the search box and hit enter. Click on the link and scroll down a little bit and you can read about the GPNC option. Thank you for watching.